You know, that stunning, ridiculously shiny 6.4 liter full aluminum V10 powered beast. The one that would turn the heads of even the most pretentious public out there but never got to see the light of day due to Ford's lack of conviction and vitality to sustain the project at that time. If you haven't already guessed, I'm talking about the Ford Shelby GR1. The jaw-dropping front engine, two-seat fastback concept debuted at the 2005 North American International Auto Show and perfectly blended the new and the classic into a shining display of luxury and horsepower. Just imagine leaning on that hood for a photo, perhaps with a warm, golden sunset reflecting off the bodywork. To be fair with you, my brain did just accidentally start daydreaming of that scene for about 5 minutes just now. At this point you might be saying to yourself, okay, but why all the hype about a 2005 concept that never hit the tarmac? I mean, it's 2020 and the GR1 was laid 6 feet under long ago. Well, not exactly. They now embark on the production of 325 Ford Shelby GR1 units under the 2015 Low Car Volume Manufacturers Act, following a deal struck with Ford and Shelby. The tuner will not only produce aluminum-bodied coupes, as well as carbon fiber bodies, but will even take the game as far as developing an electric version. 200 pieces will be aluminum special edition vehicles, while the rest will feature carbon fiber bodies. You've read it well folks, it's finally happening. One key difference from the original concept, according to Stander himself, is that the V10 engine will be replaced by a 700 plus horsepower, supercharged V8 similar to that of the 2020 Mustang Shelby GT500. The automatic Tremec dual clutch transmission of the GT500 will also run on the GR1, and plans extend from a 6-speed manual to a fully electric drivetrain. Super Performance's newly revived Ford Shelby GR1 won't hit the roads for another two years, which might seem like a while, but that's certainly better than never, right? Now, realistically speaking, I'll probably never be the happy owner of one of these beauties on wheels. But that's okay, I just want to see the baby go. So shiny, so perfect.